Part of being a video optimizer means, first and foremost, being a video watch optimizer. And with YouTube's recent home page changes, there are some great new features that I think you should be aware of. Let's take a peek. <laughs> and here we are in the new YouTube homepage. Right off the bat, you'll see new comments and messages featured right at the top. Nice. The new homepage also acts more like a Twitter or Facebook feed with the ability to show all activity, subscriptions, or just recommended videos. All activities shows exactly that. Any activity that a friend or subscriber has done, including liking or favoriting or uploading videos. Subscriptions shows you just the uploaded videos of the users you subscribe to, and recommendations are YouTube's best guesses of videos you might like based on videos you've watched or liked in the past. When I'm looking for hot new vids to watch, I tend to go straight for the subscriptions tab. Here all the activities are organized by username with the most recent activities at the top. You'll notice that as you hover over each video, you'll see this plus sign in the bottom right corner of the thumbnail. Clicking on the plus sign will add the video to the queue. A queue is a temporary playlist and will appear at the bottom of the homepage as you add videos. As you scroll through your feed, you can also choose specific playlists to add a video to. Like for this video, I'll click on the arrow next to the plus sign and add it to... I'll add it to... Mm, my watch later playlist. Or if you're not interested in a particular video, you can ignore it, or you can click on the blue X near the top right corner and get it out of your life. This is a great way to sift through the most recent videos from your friends and users you subscribe to without having to leave the home page. And when you get to the bottom of the page, you can load more videos and continue to pick the videos that interest you the most. You get it. Now, back up to the top right of the homepage, you'll see the day's spotlight videos, trending videos, and featured videos. And if you see anything you like, you can just as easily add them to your collection of playlists. So let's say you've made some sweet selections for your queue and you want to get watching. You can go down to your playlist bar and hit the play button on the left. You can save or clear your queue, or you can expand the bar on the right hand side and remove videos or change their order. I'm going to press play and the first video in queue will begin playing. When it's finished, it'll automatically move on to the next video in my queue. You can turn the autoplay off or you can play the videos from your playlist in a random order. <laughs> That's so random. Back in the options, you can pull up a list of all the playlists you've created, including the standard watch later playlist. So now I can just press play and start busting bots. Well, there you have it. Feel free to try it out for yourself and get watch optimizing. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments below and I'll get back to you. This video is over. Please subscribe. <laughs>